It turns out people don't know knives are sharp. Knife Amazon reviews coming up next. Hey gang, Tony here. I was buying a bread knife recently. As you know, I like to bake some sourdough breads every once in a while. And it turns out that as I was going through the reviews, there were a lot of like, uh, uh, this took me by surprise, a lot of pictures of cut fingers and hands. I compiled some reviews to read to you because these things are just insane. First review here, great knife. They gave it five stars. After a few beers, cut my palm while slicing a bagel in half. I seen blood on the blade and sliced the bagel without effort. Just wasn't believing it was the knife that sliced me. Next, I ran my finger over the blade and bled instantly. Ow. Debunking my suspicion. Cut his palm, didn't believe it was the knife that he was using, because it's more likely the bagel cut him, so ran his finger over the blade, just to be sure. That's a good one. Be careful, it's really sharp. That's the title of our next review <coughs> of a knife. This is one sharp knife. I have eight stitches in my left index finger to prove it. That, of course, was my fault, and the result of a momentary lack of attention while slicing a loaf of ciabatta bread. But I can say with very personal authority that this knife slices cleanly and almost painlessly. I'm not sure that that second part is really necessary for uh, a good knife, that it slices pain painlessly, unless you're planning on cutting yourself, which apparently some of these people are. I don't know. Ow. 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 Let's go next. The title of this review is Super Sharp. This knife needs a cover. It is so sharp. See photo. I barely graze the blade. That is a great thing in terms of what a knife should do. It cuts bread beautifully. Hmm. This next review is entitled, Perfect for Foam. Super, super sharp. I already cut myself, so just be careful. Perfect for foam. <laughs> next review. It's entitled, Sharp. This knife is incredibly sharp. I have owned this knife for less than a week and I have cut myself twice. Merely brushing your finger near the blade will produce a profusely bleeding cut. Great knife, but be careful. I mean, I want to question why they're brushing their finger over the blade, but I'm not really sure at this point it matters. Ow. Outstanding bread knife. Alright, this is a promising review. Outstanding bread knife. Best knife I have ever owned. Good. End it there. Don't tell me anymore. Oh, oh god. Word of caution. This knife is razor sharp. Interesting that reviewers feel the need to tell other people that a knife is sharp. Recurring theme here, I think. Be careful with it and do not let the kids use it. Oh dear god. I cut myself just getting it out of the packaging. I have used it to cut everything and it takes almost no pressure at all to cut bread. Well, that's good news, but uh, be careful with the packaging there. Alright, here's our last one. You guys ready for this? Our last review of the day? This one is entitled, 
Love the sharp bread knife. First word of the review. All caps. Sharp. Period. You've been warned. I got the 10 inch bread knife and it cuts a tough loaf of bread like it's room temperature butter. So fun! Exclamation point. I joined the ranks of accidentally cutting myself by underestimating the sharpness. Whoops! That's... that's in the review. So ends our saga of Amazon reviewers who don't know that bread knives are sharp. You've been warmed. Read Deep of the Night.